Hey, it's Frank here with 4D Honeybee. It's four days after my mite treatment with Apivar, and I just want to check out the hives and see if there's anything on the bottom boards because um, just, just in the area, I guess. Um, I don't have a great expectation here because it's a long-term treatment. It's a minimum 42-day treatment because the only way they can spread the chemical is to uh, actually walk or rub themselves on it. So it's not like a fume or something like that. So it's going to take a while, but... I'm just going to check it out here. It's the beauty of having these bottom boards. As you can see, oh yeah, lots of mites. Holy smokes. You see all those dots there are all dead mites. And there are thousands of them. Wow. Okay, that's just after four days. So they definitely were there, weren't there. This is not the cleanest bottom board to begin with because it's an old one, but... Um, Clearly those dots were not there when I cleaned it off when I installed the Apivar strips. Middle hive now, this is my weak hive, and I'm hoping the Apivar won't harm the bees here. Oh, and look, so just in four days we've had one, two, three, four frames of brood hatch out, and again, thousands of dead mites. Look at them, hundreds maybe, if not thousands. All those dots there are all mites. See if I can show you one kind of up close so that is definitely a mite as are all those so all those dots are basically mites last hive same wow thousands of mites just four days in wow that's a real good sign and you know the other neat thing is you look at this hive here in the middle it looks like a lot of the the concentration of mites happen around occur around where the brood is hatching out so maybe I, I suggest that's a good sign because it shows that um, you're getting the mites that are either attached to the larva or the brood or in that area so I'd say that's that's a good thing still have a, a month to go in the treatment plus but uh, so far the apivar has worked I do see a little bit of bee mortality here and over here where I've put out uh, a few frames just to allow the bees to rob them, a few frames of nectar. But there's uh, some mortality on top of this box for some reason. And it may, that could have been just to do with the high intensity robbing activity, don't know. This guy's seeming okay. But, so that's it. So, so far the Apivar is working and uh, we're getting rid of a lot of mites. I tried intensely to look for mites and I could not find a single one. I tried intensely to look for, um, for deformed wings, could not find any, but that goes to show you that they're there in the thousands. So you definitely do not want to go into winter with a strong mite, strong mite population. So thanks for joining me. I'll uh, do another update maybe in a week or so.